practice indoors, we practice outdoors, and we did it on to get something accomplished this year. And we're very proud of it. And at this time, uh, I want to give a special thanks to a young lady, Karen Masters. Where are you? Can we get her? Go get her. soothers to someone who will give you a massage on your shoulders if you really ask for it. I mean, it's, it's, it's great. But just the team and the work we put in, it, it's not all, that's not just us. There's, there's things that go on behind the scenes, like extra hours of practice. Dalton had to run like 12 extra miles this year. For parents, y'all are always there for us. People always offering, hey, look, we'll take you to drills if you want to come. Uh, coach, coach, we probably have the best two coaches here. By far, we did the most running this year. Um, I'm, uh, I ain't Coach Hands with that. But, I mean, they're always there for us. It, it can be Saturday morning, you wake up and you're like, man, I feel like playing tennis today. Who, who, who do I want to play with? And you just text Coach, hey, Coach, can you meet me at the course at 12? No, absolutely. Would, wouldn't miss it. It's just been, it's been a great season. And we're a young, young GERD team. We, we really are. I mean, Dalton was our only senior out of both teams. I mean, we're going to miss him when he's gone. You bring a lot, lot to this team, Dalton, because you're 
southern drawl and <laughs> your silly, awkward, funny <laughs> lingo on the court. Son of a biscuit. Son of a biscuit. That's the same thing. <laughs> and Dylan. Add them together, you feel like you got the country duo coming out of Texas. <laughs> say that this is probably the best team that this is this is my favorite team we've had so far. I, I love every single one of you. Uh, special shout out to my bro Bo. I told him I was going to give him a shout out. Inspiration right there. He hit home. I'm just kidding. I'm not just proud. I, I love every single one of you. Parents, Jeb, Brad. Y'all are all special to me.
enjoying it while we play. And also, Miss Lewis and Coach Han were very good at um, keeping you settled down and keeping your confidence up because a lot of us have problems with confidence, and I'm one of them. But they always pushed you because they knew you could do it. And then um, I'm, we're just really excited for the goals that we have set. Um, hopefully, we'll win region next year because we'll be working hard again. And I'm really excited. And I want to thank the parents and our coaches. skills and when you learn how to hit that tennis ball right you have more fun and then you start hitting it better and better and better and then you start having more fun more fun because you can drop shots slide slide do crazy stuff with the ball you know and so but anyway we're going to move on with the awards and uh <laughs> sensitive mic we're going to give out letters and so at this time, we're going to give out the letters to the young men. Um, and if you would, just hand me the folders so I can. Inside of the folders, some players will receive a letter C, a bar, or a tennis pin. They'll receive a team picture, a letter, and some information on tennis camps and tournaments coming up this weekend. We'd like for you to sign up and play, and if you can, if you have time. So we'll start with Kayla Whitmire. If you'll come up, you get a letter. <laughs> Caleb last year broke his leg, lower leg last year in PE. And the young man wasn't able to finish the season with us. But he came out this year. We appreciate your dedication. You're getting better and better and better. Work hard this summer because you'll be good at you. All right, coming up next, we have uh, Isaac Taylor. summer, went through rehab, and uh, he's turned out to be a fantastic player this year. The maturity, stay there, <laughs> don't sneak away. He's grown up a lot, he's shown a lot of leadership, and we hope that continues. Good job. Stay there. 
Trice, this is his freshman year. He's also very young. Has a lot of potential. And he's going to take a lot of lessons and drills this, this summer from him. And get better. And work on everything. Good job this year. Get a letter, C, plus pen, tennis pen. Avery's also, he's a sophomore, but it's his first year. I just wanted to ask you a question. I didn't ask this earlier to you, Avery. Have you ever played tennis before you came on our team? That's what I thought. Okay. <laughs> just tease away. Stay right there. I'm going to say something to you. Avery, it was his first year. He came out in the fall, worked real hard. He's left-handed. And if you're a right-handed person, to teach someone left-handed, you have to say everything opposite. So if I tell him right-handed, it's, it's all, you know, it messes up in your head sometimes. But anyway, Avery worked hard. He came around, and he and Dylan fought out at number two, double spot, forever. The marathon match for the weekend. But Avery, proud of what you accomplished. Thank you. singles for us. We put him in a tough spot this year, but he handled it very well. And I'll say more about you later. Have a good day. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Bob Hand was not able to make it with us tonight, but uh, his dad is here, correct? If you come up, Bob is going to receive uh, a letter and a box. Bob played number three singles for us, and uh, we're very proud of him and what he's about. Now we're going to move on to the young ladies. Kayla No, it's her second year. It's a letter and a bar. Jordan Mitchell, first year freshman. A letter, it's a let's see, and a tennis pin. This young lady played number three singles. We're very proud of her. She receives a letter and a ball. And we have one more player who's at a band concert along with Bob Hand, Rajane Hames. I think I got that name right. Uh, she received a letter, a C, and a tennis pin. Uh, now, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to go to the main awards and talk about the season a little bit. Go with the ladies first. Ladies, could y'all just stand and face the audience? <laughs> I like for you to, uh, these young ladies are all tennis players. They're at different levels, but their chemistry is awesome. Their record was six and 10, but that, that does not, that does not 
tell the whole story of how good and how close their matches were. We had two matches that went two and three. Their record could have been easily eight and eight. So what I want to tell the parents is that these kids have the ability to do a lot next year. We're going in a different region, and we should be in the top two. That's our goal. Coach Han and I has already, we have, we have already stated that, and we want you to make that your goal. So give these girls a big hand. Do it. goes to a young lady uh, that worked real hard at the beginning of the year. She was working on strokes, trying to hit that forehand, the backhand down the line, trying to learn how to serve. And she practiced and she practiced and she practiced and she practiced. And in her matches, she would hustle all the time, work on the strokes, try the strokes in the matches. Of course, she, she missed a lot, but she got better as the year went on. And this award goes to Thank you, Ray. We love you. Good job. This next award is a hustle award. When we watch our young ladies play their matches, this young lady, I'll just be honest with you, started out with no experience, worked real hard in practice. Eager, eager to learn, had fun doing it. Um, unconventional strokes, but later developed better strokes, and hustled all the time on the court. This hustle award goes to Kirsten Holmes.